Captain, something's wrong. The breach in the dome hasn't been regenerated. Our sensors are detecting a signal transmitted from within. We think this is preventing the dome from regenerating itself. Wait, are you saying that zombies are broadcasting a signal? The inside of the dome is still a mystery. Follow the coordinates I've just sent you to find the source of the signal and neutralize it ASAP. I was afraid of her saying that. Encounter anything like this the last time. Oh, I can't believe I'm back here again. Captain, we tracked a signal to the hospital. What's the situation there? We can't contain the undead waves for now, but they will soon overwhelm us. Hurry up!
Oh, these aren't undead bodies. These people have just died. They must be the survivors. Looks like we weren't able to save them the first time. The question is, which vile bastard is butchering these people? Break 15 years ago, his name was one of the first engraved on the Clover Residence Memorial. My high school was even named after Dr. Andy McCoy. Dead, honored, or forgotten, it is irrelevant. You've been busy with running experiments as you like for years, while people were naming schools after you, right? Everything was fine until you arrived and cut off my specimen resources. Specimens? Are you talking about the people we rescued two months ago? Affirmative, but I estimated that you would eventually come back. Fortunate, too, as I am in dire need of a metahuman specimen. And you dragged us here by preventing the dome from regenerating itself. Congratulations, Butcher. A perfect method of committing suicide. This much trouble, Doctor?
Do you think that in a world where the geist of dead musicians are still recording albums, nothing would ever gape you in awe? Well, I'm pretty sure you have changed your mind after watching the magnificent light show in the sky tonight. Hashtag Clover Residence. Hashtag Geist. Guys, there are some people here who would like to thank you. They are all free now. <laughs>